Dozens of Hawaii soldiers are preparing for a return trip to Afghanistan as the Hawaii Army National Guard makes its last scheduled deployment during Operation Enduring Freedom. KITV Force Paul Drews has more from today's deployment ceremony. Sergeant Fred Dona holds on tightly to his little girl, just part of his family he'll leave behind as he deploys for a third time. Knowing that in you know, less than uh, 48 hours uh, I'll be leaving them again, uh, it's, it's emotional, but uh, I say family, uh, if you got the good support at home, I mean, you, you can get through anything. What he and these soldiers have to get through is another deployment to Afghanistan, the second in three years. During their last time there, they took part in flying over 6,000 hours on missions around the country, and they expect to be very busy this deployment as well. There's been a lot of talk about the drawdown of troops in Afghanistan, and this unit will play a big role in that. The unit maintains and flies a dozen of these Chinook helicopters, the heavy lifters of the military. In the mountainous terrain of Afghanistan, these choppers are crucial to the current mission. There will probably be a lot more um, transporting uh, equipment and troops back, um, supporting the drawdown and the pullout of the uh, American troops. Nearly half of this unit deployed to Afghanistan in 2010, so many are familiar with the dangers and challenges of a war zone deployment. But for Sergeant Joshua Pastor, all the hard work ahead will also come with a little extra reward. It'll be a lot easier knowing that we're uh, helping those guys out because uh, we're just primarily the uh, main mode of transportation up there. And so it's to see other soldiers' faces smiling, knowing that they're going home. These soldiers, though, are leaving home. While the military mission rests squarely on the soldiers of the men and women of Bravo Company, the hardships of their deployment are shared by everyone, young and old. Being that we're, we're going back so soon, um, you know, a lot of the uh, I guess, pressures on, on the families, um, you know, soldiers leaving again, and, and a lot of families, uh, single family. At Wheeler Army Airfield, Paul Drews, KITV4 News. The soldiers will ship out Monday for two months of training in Texas before heading to Afghanistan. This is the last large group of Hawaii Army National Guard soldiers to go. After this, small detachments may head to the Middle East to help with training.